hello friend welcome you again today i am going to show you how you can export your graph in an efficient way in graphpad prism to export the graph here you can see export option is available and this export option you can also get if you left click on file you can see export option is available here and shortcut is control shift e but in case of mac it will be command shift e and if you keep the cursor at export icon here you can see the format in which you can export your graph left click on export button here you can see new export graph window is open and the first option is file format and if you click here on this drop down window you can see there are many format available to export the graph and based on your selection of format there will be change in the menu below this and in this drop down window you can see enhanced meta file plus windows meta file portable document format and the eps these five format are the vector image format and the rest four like tiff jpg png bmp these file format are the raster image file format so based on your selection there will be change in the properties of figure or graph so i'm going to select the pdf first here you can see the first option is changing the background color if you want to keep clear you can select this one otherwise you can leave white resolution is not showing here because we cannot select the resolution in vector image file format and color model you can select the color model here like cmyk rgb gray style according to your requirement you can select like if you need black and white image or graph just select grayscale this will allow you to export your graph in black and white but i'm going to select the rgb and the next is size you can change the size of graph here if you want to make any changes you can change it here and other option like compression is not available for the pdf and where to export in this you can see here file name and folder you can rename your file here i'm renaming the export one for this pdf export and the folder you can select your location of folder in which you want to export your graph and below this you can see open this folder after exporting if you check this this will allow you to open the folder after export and if you want to make these things default you can check this box otherwise you can leave it blank click here on ok and like this if you want to export other format left click on this export icon select the file format i'm going to select here eps and according to your requirement change the color model size and here is the other option also available export text as you can choose according to your requirement same like file name and folder so i'm going to change the file name export to click ok you can see here eps format graph is exported and if you want to see that you can open in adobe illustrator so you can see they are very high quality images and you can use in your publication and now i'm going to show you raster image export just click here select the format for the raster image like i'm going to select tiff and here i'm going to select the resolution like now you can see in the case of raster image format resolution is open and you can select 100 300 600 1200 dpi i'm going to select 600 color model you can see there are more color mode here you can select that you want to keep and also change your size and you can also make your compression if you need rest of the thing is similar to rename the file export 3. here you can see tip format is exported like this if you want to export in other format just change the file format here jpg rename your file so you can see it is very easy to export the graph in graphpad print and now i am going to show you a very efficient way to direct export the graph in powerpoint or word and it is very easy and also very important for the publication point of view or presentation point of view like if you click here on this icon powerpoint you can see it directly exported the graph to the powerpoint and the good thing is about this direct export 
you can close the graphpad print file even though this graph is embedded in this powerpoint along with the prism file as an object and you can open from here in the print and you can make changes and that changes will be updated in this graph so like if you want to share your data with your colleague or friend using this direct exported file they will be able to open this graph in graphpad print if they have installed the graphpad print in their system and they can make changes or they can modify the data and that changes will be updated in this presentation so it is very important to export the data like this you can also ex direct export to the world very easily i'm going to keep here in the light mode you can see graph is exported directly to the word and this is also embedded in this word you can open even though if you close the graphpad print file and you can also share this and the your colleague or friend will be able to open in the graphpad print and modify further that changes will be updated in this file as well now i am going to show you another way to export the data that is also very important for this you can copy the graph from here if you click here on the edit you can see the option copy or you can use the shortcut ctrl c or command c in case of mac and you can open the powerpoint or word and here go to the home paste paste special here you can see there is many option available here if you select the graph pad print project object your graph is embedded in this powerpoint and you can open as a separate individual file because this object is embedded as a print so this is also very important and the similar thing you can perform in the world and if you are trying to copy and paste so paste your graph using the special paste option that will be very good for you so you can see it is very easy to export your data in graphpad print using the export option in different file format as well as direct export in powerpoint as well as in the word and now i'm going to show you the layout option so i have shown you to export the graph but you can also export the layout like if you select the layout here you can perform the same export option for the layout as well like if you select this you can select your file format you can rename your file this export you can see your whole layout is exported you can also direct export this layout just click on powerpoint you can see your whole layout is exported so it is very easy to perform the data export in graphpad free and if you are facing any problem let me know i will try to provide information as much as possible and thank you for watching my video if you like the video please subscribe my channel thank you